Hello, hello, hello. It's Tony Horton and the Tony Horton Life Show. See what I did there? And you know what? Today's um, show is about something that I think has great value for a lot of people because I'm guessing that maybe a large percent of, percentage of you out there is dealing with stress. Man, oh man, you think you're doing just fine, you're hydrated, you're getting your sleep, you're getting the right nutrition, all right supplements, you know what I mean? You're trying to keep everything on the straight and narrow, but life is funny. There are these external forces that come in and they mess with you. And so sometimes it's hard to have the willpower or the wherewithal or the internal strength to be able to deal with these external forces. And it can happen with anybody. It can happen with people in your family, people at work, traffic, you know what I mean? Right here in LA right now, it's like 102 degrees. That alone is very stressful on the body, on the mind, on all aspects of who you are. And so quite often, you know, I always talk about meditation. Meditation is a great option for a lot of people. It doesn't have to be anything other than just closing your eyes and just trying to clear out your mind. And, um, but I really want to talk about something that's a little different than meditation today, and that is conscious breathing. Because when I'm stressed out, all right, when I'm dealing with things that are just seem too overwhelming sometimes, you know, I'm always, I'm the solution guy, always looking for solutions. What can I do? Okay, here's the problem. I've established what it is. What are my action steps? I'm an action step kind of guy. But sometimes, my heart is racing so fast and I am so freaked out and it's true. I mean, oh, look at Tony Horton, Mr. Cool, who struggles. Yeah, yeah, I do. And so I use this technique and you can call it Win Hoff if you want to. Darren O'Lean, a good friend of mine, of course, the co-creator of Shakeology, turned me on to some Win Hoff exercises and this is kind of Win Hoff-esque. It's kind of Win Hoff slash Tony Horton breathing technique. I call it conscious breathing technique because quite often, when we're breathing, regardless of whether we're exercising or just chatting with our friends or we're in a situation that feels kind of stressful, we're not really conscious of our breath. We're just breathing to survive, getting through the moment, getting through the day, right? And so this technique is something that you can do maybe just one round of it and sometimes two and three and four rounds. Now, I went to bed last night. I had this thing that was on my mind last night. Boy, it was just crushing me, and there was no way I was going to fall asleep. I was laying on my back, staring at the ceiling, and I went, okay, it's time for my, my, my 10 inhales. And uh, it goes like this. Let me explain it. I'm actually going to do it, and if you want to join me, great, or you can just stand there and stare at me, and you're going to think he's just breathing, and that's kind of a weird show. But I want this thing here on Facebook, this particular type of show, to be interactive. This is a technique that I use for myself to help bring my heart rate down, help me fall back asleep, help me kind of regroup inside my head so that I can keep moving and be the proactive person and be the action step guy. But sometimes you're just crushed and meditation doesn't feel like the thing that you want to do. So here it is. You're going to take, you and I both, are going to take 10 big inhales through your nose only. And at the 10th inhalation, inhalation, uh, you're going to hold your breath for a 10 count. And that's going to really uh, help you. This is going to create a little bit of stress doing that. Uh, you're going to maybe feel a little bit anxious because you're going to be holding your breath for a 10 count. And then you let that next exhale out. And you'll notice that if you do a round or two or three or four, the inhalations and exhalations become bigger and bigger. Now, last night when I was laying in bed, it took me four. So one, two, three, four, in and out, and then holding my breath. And then I thought, is that enough? No. Two was not enough. Three, not enough. And at the end of four, I finally felt like I was back in my own body again. I felt like I was finally relaxed again. And I fell asleep relatively quickly. And to be perfectly honest, at five o'clock in the morning, I woke up in a panic again about what I was dealing with. And I had to do it again. And then I slept right through till 7.30. So uh, you want to try it with me? Here we go. A little Win Hof-esque. Um, so, Initially, when you first start out, especially when you're anxious, it's kind of freaky and hard to do big inhalations and exhalations. So you don't have to match me. You know, you can just, you can come close or do something within the ballpark, but I'm going to do four in a row right now. And if I look a little dreamy after the fourth one, it's because this stuff works. So are you ready? Here we go. I think that's enough chit chat about it. 
through your nose only. I'm sitting down on two pillows. This is comfortable for me, sitting up nice and tall. You can do this here if you want. If you're, if you, you can sit in a chair. I don't, it doesn't matter to me. Don't make it overly complicated. Don't overthink it. All right. So, for me, it helps if I'm in sort of a, I don't know, whatever position, cross-legged position. I get sometimes put my hands here. I put it here on my lap. Anyway, I'm talking more. So let's get busy. I'm just comfortable right here, trying to get the crown of my head up nice and tall. <clears throat> and I might, you can do it with your eyes open or closed. I might go back and forth. I might say some things while I'm breathing just so you don't, you know, you don't get completely bored with me breathing. But prepare yourself right now. If you're seeing this for the first time, I'll give you a few more minutes, you know, scuffle around, find a chair, whatever, close some doors, turn off your phone or put it on airplane mode, whatever it is, and we're going to get busy. It's going to happen right now. Are we ready? Ten inhalations. Hold it on the tenth, and we'll do three more after that. Here goes. You're going you're gonna to notice a difference. Oh, I know. I can't stop myself. Check to see how you feel right now before doing it. Like, just do a little inventory. Well, I don't know. I feel a little bit stressed out. On a scale of one to ten, where are you? You know, maybe right now, seeing this for the first time, you're fine. And then you're really going to feel some changes afterward. But try it again later down the road when you're, when you're kind of freaking and you can't deal with stuff. All right, so I'm officially done talking. And go. Seven. There's eight. Nine. And now. Uh, on 10. We're going to do that three more times. Here we go. As you can see, I did a little exhale through my mouth. That's a violation. Don't let that happen to you. Here we go. Take a big inhale and hold here. <clears throat> Things are changing. Two more times.
one more time. Now, on this last one, make sure your stomach's expanding, chest expanding, lungs expanding, rib cage opening. Here we go, last time. See if you can increase the inhalation and exhalation. I already feel pretty loopy, but we're gonna go for one more. I don't know about you. That's four. Five. Halfway in the last one. And six. Seven. Eight. Two more. Big inhale and hold. <clears throat> oh, man. <laughs> Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes. Wow. <sighs> ah! <laughs> okay. Hope I didn't embarrass myself there a little bit. Um, so everything's humming. Fingers are humming. The tops of my ankles are humming. All up and down my spine is buzzing. My ears are ringing. Uh, my face is, feels flush. I don't know if it's a different color. But, uh, but I'm not mad. <laughs> and I'm not angry. And I'm not stressed. I wasn't really stressed when we all started. I, was, I felt pretty good. I wanted to share this with you guys and gals and see what you thought about it. Um, I want to do something atypical, something you haven't ever seen me do before you know, on Facebook or YouTube. So, uh, I'll tell you, I feel very present. Extremely present. The past, the future, whatever. I mean, some of you might think this is weird and goofy and what's Tony doing? I don't, you know, whatever. It's all good. But I feel great. And um, I'm curious uh, how you feel. And um, this is me, Tony Horton, with my little inhalation exhalation at the 10th inhalation hold your breath uh, exercise I gotta come up with a better name I think but I want to hear from you I want to hear what you think write those comments down um, the beautiful thing about the Tony Horton life the show on Facebook um, this watch tab is I don't have to get them in in 45 seconds or a minute and a half max I want to get more involved I want to share some cool things with all of you and, and this is one that I needed last night, desperately. So, instead of going for the booze, or smoking the J, or taking all your feelings out on somebody you love, or doing something stupid, try this. It will alter you. Anyway, thank you. Tony Horton for Tony Horton Life. I hope you loved that as much as I loved sharing it with you. We'll see you next time.